Hey guys, welcome back to the next part. So in the previous part I talked about wanting to replace this regulator now. These regulators, the 70, the 7405s do fail on occasion. Basically what it does is it takes the 9 volt input and drops it down to 5 volt and then the excess is gotten rid of in the form of heat. Hence this big muckle heat sink you see here, which is dangerously close to the ULA and sits above the, the Z80 and other chips. So I'm not really... Back in the day, there's nothing really you could do about this. Now there is. This is a Traco power. TSR 1-2405. This is a modern drop-in replacement for that. So... This whole thing here will go, disappear, gone, be replaced by this little thing here, which I will just open up for you now. So there is some argument about keeping the originality of the machine, etc, etc. I'm more concerned about the ULA dying, so I'm going to replace the bloody regulator. That's something a bit more modern now. As you can see here, that is a lot smaller. Um, the pin pitch and everything is pin compatible with here. So I don't know about you can see this, this camera's not brilliant for this. It doesn't really have a macro. So the procedure will be as follows. First of all, we need to get rid of the seat sink. So, full headed screwdriver. There's a nut on the other end of this, so we just in, crack the nut. Here it comes. There's a nut going out now. Sink off. Next part is to get rid of the regulator. So, what I'll do is I will put some fresh, so I'll put some flux and some fresh solder on this, heat it up, and use a sucker to get rid of it. And you'll see that in a second. I'm not going to try and do it on camera because I'm, yeah. Right, so it's in. I've just placed it quickly back in this case. See the screen's off. Plug it in. Boom! Perfect, so there we go. No more huge heat sink. All gone. Just that tiny little component there. So these are not cheap. That was six pounds, whereas you can get a, a seventy four oh five for what under a pound, two pounds. But it's a lot more efficient, and as you can tell, and I know there's the originality argument, but to be frank, don't really care. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.